Well, hello there, it's Krint and welcome to another Creative Swim video. Today we are going to work on the Tipton family. So, Magnolia Tipton lives in the mansion that I built yesterday and she is a spoiled brat. So, Magnolia Tipton is um, inspired, heavily inspired by Paris Hilton and, you know, her name, Magnolia, I, I assume that Paris, like, she was conceived in Paris, I don't know, but Magnolia's name comes because her father has, like, a massive um, store in uh, Magnolia Promenade. And Tipton is because from the sweet life of Zack and Cody, like, I don't remember her, like, you know, name, but her surname was Tipton. So, I always imagined that, you know, it's inspired by Hilton. So I thought that was a funny thing to do. Um, her father is like very rich and her mother is dead. I haven't really thought how she died, but she is dead. I also don't know about Paris Hilton's mother. Is she dead? I assume so. I don't know. I have no idea, whatever. Um, and yeah, her mother is dead, so she was raised, raised, quote-unquote, by her father, who was never there. But, you know, to make up for the time that he wasn't there, he just spoiled her. And she grew up, essentially, with the butler of the family that now works, or like, more likely, looks over uh, Magnolia. So... Uh, she grew up being very spoiled and very rich, so she thinks she deserves everything and, you know, everything is hers. And she's a party girl, she's a global superstar, of course she is. Um, and she has, I think, four quirks. Vane Street, which, you know, she loves looking at mirrors. Um, she also has the, I think... I don't recall, god damn. I just did that yesterday and I don't recall it now. The other one is like the Juice Holy, so she really wants juices. And if you watched the speed build yesterday, you would notice that um, we have loads of bars uh, on the mansion. And I don't recall the other two because I'm really good at it. <laughs> and she has a little dog which we're going to go on him in a while. And of course, it is a chihuahua because Paris Hilton had a chihuahua. Um, and as you can see, like, she has party outfits, she dresses to impress, of course. Um, I really wanted uh, her to look mean. <laughs> Does that make any sense? But I don't think she looks mean. <laughs> Which made me very upset. Like, I like her as I see her. I'm like, yes, it's very pretty. So... He didn't do well on that part. And of course, she's very skinny because all she does is drink and sleep. So she doesn't really eat or exercise at all, as you can see. Um, but of course, she had like a couple of plastic surgeries. As you can see, like a boob one, a little bit of a lip injection. So, yeah. Uh, it's, I don't know. I feel like it was funny and slightly based i don't know if paris hilton had um any surgeries but i would assume she had so yeah as you can see like she has expensive clothes she wears um those are obviously are not her realized so she wears contacts to change the color and i don't know she doesn't have any real friends and she mostly parties that's her that's the most shallow personality they could ever think of. And this is her dog. Of course, the name of it is Angel. Because why the hell not? And it's the most obnoxious chihuahua you will ever meet. And that's the butler of the family. Um, I really like the butler. I like the butler more than I like... Um, actually her. <laughs> so the butler, as I told you, works um, for the family for ages. And she basically raised Tipton, Tipton, Magnolia, and, you know, Magnolia doesn't really like him, 
but he is super nice and I guess I kind of based him off the Batman Butler, Alfred I think was his name, I think, I'm not completely sure, and he doesn't have a family, he has a sister which I haven't made yet, and he has all those, um, I guess, but like, you know, he has her, um, Kazam, I blacked out. No, the kids of her cousin, no, cousin sister, as you know, his own kids. So he never really wanted to leave because he feels like Magnolia also is his kid, even though they don't really like each other. Um, and his traits, I will go ahead and change them a bit later. But you can see, like, he has a couple cute outfits, and I really wanted him to look grandpa like. Does this make sense? Like, you know, this cute, adorable grandpa that everyone would love to have, like, again, ignore his traits. Um, but yeah, just. <laughs> I think he's adorable and I really like him and I kind of based him off my father it's it's kind of weird because he's not <laughs> a grandpa but uh, yeah <laughs> like I based him a bit of my father like how he dresses and a bit of how I see elders dress around here so yeah that's the little family not much like not a very deep story <laughs> because again the first character, the main character, is very shallow. So that is it. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And I will see you next week with another video. I hope that you will have an amazing day and take care. Bye!